Join us as we dive one of the most popular shipwrecks in Cozumel, the Felipe. Known as the Cozumel Wreck, the Felipe, or C-53, is perhaps one of the most popular dive wrecks and dive sites in Mexico. The ship itself is 154 feet long, 33 feet wide, and was sunk to land perfectly upright resting on the seabed in 80 feet of water. Here, our divers are using this ship to block the strong currents which flush by this wreck. In 1962, the Philippe was decommissioned and sold to the Mexican Navy and was renamed ARM General Philippe C-53, where she patrolled the Gulf of Mexico and Caribbean Sea, serving as a search and rescue mission patrolling for illegal arms and drug trafficking. After 55 years of service, the ship was finally decommissioned in 1999 and donated to the Cozumel Underwater Park and sunk in 1999 in 82 feet of water to be turned into an artificial reef. The Felipe attracts many types of fish, including these bonnetmouth feeding on plankton. And where there are smaller plankton feeding fish, there are sure to be, well, you guessed it, the predators like these group are patrolling the ship for an easy meal. The two props that once propelled the Philippe across the Caribbean now lie coral encrusted on the sandy bottom. The superstructure of the ship rises 40 feet from the seabed allowing divers to reach the superstructure of the wreck by descending just 20 feet from the surface. This sea bass felt so comfortable with his camouflage against the coral, he let me get real close. One of the many predators patrolling the reefs and this wreck is the Great Grouper. Although my dive buddies were in the interior of the ship enjoying themselves, I stayed outside by myself, but didn't feel alone. I had many friends swimming around me. Off in the distance, I see my buddy Leeds coming from the top of the superstructure of this wreck, which means they're done exploring the interior, and it's time for me to join back up with them once again. Our first diver to come around the corner is Eric Alexander. And our second diver, Jeremy Fishinger, giving us the nod that all's good. And bringing up the rear, Dive Master Lee Butcher, or as we like to call him, Bubbles Boucher. And up on the wheelhouse, looks like Eric's giving us a nice little howdy. Since I didn't have proper lighting for my video camera, I decided not to follow Eric into the interiors of the ship. Here Carlos is going to demonstrate perfect buoyancy control 